To improve significantly, I'll be giving you the five best exercises you need to boost your cycling performance and why they are so important for you. The reasons will surprise you. The four main benefits of this exercise is to improve your core stability, unilateral strength and balance, engages all major muscle groups, and improves the stability and control of your scapula. This is the Renegade Row, and it's an amazing exercise to maximize efficiency on the bike. The Renegade Row involves a plank position with your legs and back in a nice straight line. This mimics the position on the bike when you're down in the arrow bars on race day. Muscles prioritized in this Renegade Row is pretty extensive. So instead of listing them all out, which would take a long time, I'm simply gonna say that it activates a lot of the muscle groups that you need for cycling. Next up, we have the lunges. They're gonna fire up the major muscle groups that are crucial for cycling, including your glutes, quads and calves, and hamstrings. There are several benefits of doing lunges. Improved balance and coordination, improved hip flexibility, muscular symmetry and strengthening in the legs, glutes, and core. Thank you to the 850 people so far that have subscribed to my channel. I'm looking to reach 1,000 subscribers by the end of the month, and I really appreciate you watching this. As a thank you, here's a dad joke for you. Why do hamburgers go to the gym? To get better buns. Now back to the video. Burpees are the full body, explosive exercise everybody loves to hate. Stringing a few together not only trains your muscles and joints, but it also raises your heart rate. My heart rate's raising just talking about them. There are also improvements in your cardiovascular fitness, muscular endurance, strengthening of your whole body, and best of all, no equipment needed. Kettlebell swings are an explosive full body exercise that is an effective way to improve your endurance and develop a stronger pedal stroke. Kettlebell swings get your heart pumping faster, which can improve your aerobic fitness. And by strengthening your core muscles, kettlebell swings can improve your posture. This posture is seen on the bike and can improve your aerodynamics. With this better posture, people who do kettlebell swings correctly have less pain in their back. The last, but definitely not the least, exercise to boost your performance on the bike is the single leg deadlift. Activating your legs, back, and core muscles this simple compound exercise will develop overall strength, increasing your power and endurance on the bike. This exercise will make you a more efficient and faster rider. Having strong hamstrings comes in handy when you really need to climb up that hill or need a break from pushing down on the pedals. Ideally, we both have a smooth pedal stroke that's equally pushing and pulling at the same time, but that's not always the case. You can string all these exercises in a circuit that I'll put on the screen right now for you to take a screenshot of. This will give you a little bit more of a cardio benefit. If you have any favorite exercises that have helped you in your cycling career, please comment below. In order to build strength, you need six plus weeks of consistent training to reap the benefits on your next bike performance. Three to five sets of two to six reps per exercise of challenging resistance will build strength in your muscles. This will help you power out of a corner or up that hill. To improve your muscular endurance, you will need six plus weeks of training at three to four sets of 12 to 20 reps to hold that pace for longer and ultimately help you get another bike PR. These are the five exercises that helped me become a strong cyclist who have dropped nearly 10 minutes in my 70.3 bike split. Now I still need to optimize my aero position to make further gains in my bike, but I'll have a video about that soon. If you enjoyed this video and want to learn about the five strengthening exercises you need to improve your swimming, then click this video.